Ok, we started guys. We started. So we are watching the, the Necromancer Po. Uh, they are trying to pressure a bit the comp team but keep their distance for now. Uh, Atari, uh, Atari Tom already took some damage. Necromancer takes some damage, Po takes some damage as well. He's trying to refresh Amp which is good. I don't think he gets the wall and meet him, that being said. Okay, some pressure with VS. We'll also go into refresh Amp. Okay, setting up for some bone spirits train. So I hope his team is giving the information. Oh, he takes a lot of damage. Oh, this is not looking good. This is not looking good. Let's see how, how things are doing for the opponent team. Because I think it's not looking good, but maybe they are super low. Okay, Hippern is the one which is a bit worse. Oh, the Barbarian goes in. Very good defense with one prison on the Hammerfield. Right, I hope this stream will get better because right now. Okay, okay, this is a massacre right now. Right goes Donald as well. Right is Po, the commander from the Rush team. And it's going to be super hard. For the for the rush team at this point, like Atari on top. No wait, wrong wrong guy. So Tom is playing max block. Yeah, he's trying to apply pressure, but it's pretty desperate at this point. Uh, the druid is LC, but there is no way for a druid to one versus four of this because there is an Amazon. Yeah, Tom is about to go down. He's not dead yet, but the, the next time he gets close to the boy, he's probably going to die instant. Father shooting at him, if I'm going aggressive or armor field. Oh, they tried to do a Corradian. Oh, it was a nice try, honestly. They tried to do a Corradian rush. Okay, round 2, 1 0 for the comp team. Comp versus rush is like in the art to play for rush team, honestly. Comp at the advantage in the current meta. So it requires a lot of coordination, or good calling to... Oh, that was a nice try. Maybe he could have catched the knight if he wasn't like in 99 FCL, sorry. Okay, uh, Atori tried to go in, but we can see that Ferdia was at Amp. Oh, and Tom goes down. Jazor goes down as well. Atori tried to go in and to deal as much damage as he can. But no one is Amp. So it's not going well. Oh no, he's 1 versus 4. Getting chase. The barb is low. Oh yeah, but he's super low, like. Skin that is at this point. Don't have time to roll summon correctly. Okay, maybe he can get the barb. The refresh amp. Okay, he used a bit of time that, the, that he had alone with the barb to try to finish him, but his block isn't enough to save him, and the barb just will kill him, and it's 2 0 for the comp team. Okay, third round 2 0 for the comp team currently. Yes, the, the Runic Ward in 2.3 are in 2.5 are like 2.6 actually. Ah, uh, they are trash, man. Like, they are uh, an embarrassment. Okay, Ipion is taking a lot of damage. It's going fairly well for the rush team. As far as I can say, like, they are having pressure on Ferdia. Ferdia is forced to move. Ipion is taking damage in the process. These are flying left or right. He take uh, even more damage and he's about to die and if he die like they can just all collapse on Ferdia and Ferdia will die and then like they will have very an easier time oh but Charlatan is super low I think he's going to die right now no he doesn't 
they managed to stabilize all the Necrogos zones the Necrogos zone so on the Barbarian also oh they were so close if they killed the Parion like the whole match would be super different But no, like, even if they kill him, it doesn't really matter because, like, over team has no neck. And the Druid goes down to Ferdia. It's only Tom, no. Okay, getting some a bit of damage on able, but like the trap scene super slow to kill people. <coughs> and they have all Barbie obviously, so and they have to face a boa zone in the end on like it's interesting to see that he swapped on Clo Clo. Like he's not playing max block anyway, and I think it's not a very bad choice. Like I think it's on the level, oh he got a period if he finish period. Like I think Clo Clo is actually fine because we have, you have fade, so you are cleansing on amp all the time. So even if you lose block, like the fact that you are not amp most of the time can compensate for it, and then like it's better also versus versus Necromancer versus uh, and versus Hammer. But arrow still hurts, like even if you are not amp obviously. So it's kind of trade off. Like, I was playing Rush Team Wall Clan War Season 2 and I know that Shu had trouble, uh, was playing at in my team, he had trouble to know if really Max Block or Clo Clo uh, was the better choice. And then we'll go to Chaser, I think. So Vil is doing, making a fine job to check if we had the amp. Oh, the barb goes down, got nice prison. Oh, he got stoned by the druid. Oh, if he was amp, he would be dead right now. It would probably be dead. So, like, that's really a shame. Good prison, cardiac, clutch the barb. Oh, nice go in from Atori, but you get instantly zipped. Name locked, destroyed dead. And. The same goes for Pong, and Tom is alone ag again. And he goes down. That one was kind of a massacre. Okay, there we go for the five round. Okay, he gets in, got. Oh, that was. I thought they were going to kill the Amazon for the moment, but it didn't go well, and three of them die instantly. Tom is alone will be in very low life so it's going to be a 5-0 I, I think yeah he's, he's just giving up or oh, ever that or he liked no no okay 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 that's it yeah that's kinda roof start for uh, for the no name team but it was to be expected honestly like when you are new to clan war like you have a lot of automatis that you don't have yet and like playing rush versus camp is also not an easy thing to do to start but they will have time to improve and I'm sure they will do better with time. <laughs> 